Here's the situation. You have a printer that looks like this, and it starts to leave color gaps in your printout. You run a print quality test, and you see gaps indicating that the print heads are clogged. So you run the routine to unclog the print heads, but afterwards, the print quality test shows even more gaps. If this sounds like your problem, then stick around, and we might have a solution for you. Let's dive in. First, what is happening? The print head has a lot of holes that squirt ink on the paper. If one of these holes is clogged, then you'll see a line in your print that is an absence of color. This is a frequent problem with brother printers. The printer has a print quality test that can show you if any of the holes are clogged. After the test is run, you're given the option to fix any dotted lines that may be missing. Selecting yes at this point will attempt to clear the holes by squirting quite a lot of ink through the holes to unclog them. Of course, this uses up your expensive ink, but is even worse is that when the result is even more clogged holes. This frequently happens and we're going to show you how to fix the problem. Let's open up the printer and uncover the left side so that we can see the area where the Brother printer purges the ink. You can see two colored wells, one that is darkish green and the other is darkish purple. These wells are actually white plastic but are now covered in ink. In fact, you can see two black lines on the top ridge of the well. This is likely what is causing the clog on the print head. You can now understand why purging more ink through the print head makes the problem worse. Even more ink builds up in the wells and covers the print head in excess ink. The solution is to clean off the ink wells and then clean the head and then clean the ink wells again. To clean the ink, we're going to use Windex and paper towels. Fold the paper towel into a small square and saturate with Windex. Then use the towel to remove the ink from the purge wells. Note that this can get very messy. Getting ink on your clothes or table can stain, so be sure that you have a garbage can close by and take your time. Throw the paper towel away and repeat the process by folding another paper towel, saturating with Windex, and cleaning the ink from the purge wells. Don't push too hard on the purge wells, just use a gentle side-to-side -side motion to wipe the ink out of the wells. When the purge well looks white, give the top edge of the purge well one last wipe to make sure that there is no ink there. With the purge wells clean, reassemble the printer. Then run the print quality test. At this point, you will likely see similar gaps missing because even though the perch well is clean, there is still ink clogging the holes on the print head. Now answer yes that there are dotted lines missing to start the print routine. Using the second icon from the left uses the least amount of ink. When cleaning is complete, answer yes to check the print head nozzles. Your print should be much better. You can repeat the head cleaning cycle if any holes still appear. Opening the printer again, we can see the ink that was just purged into the wells as part of the print head cleaning. Since you have your cleaning supplies handy, you might as well clean the wells one last time and then reassemble the printer.